going to live before you're 25. <laughs> Uh, we have a unique culture. I'm not picking on the Americans, by the way. They're sick, just sick of our kids doing all that. You're all brought well fault. And the pensioners, they see those kids walking around in groups and they label them gangs. We've got gangs now. They're not gangs. Just bored Australian kids with no idea of fashion and nothing to do. Doing what I did when I was a kid, it was just the 70s. It's true. And we weren't labelled a gang in the 70s. You a 70s kid? Yep. Yeah, no. Yeah, I did what these kids are doing. I hang out with my friends. We all wore the same clothes, made too much noise, smoked cigarettes in the park, rode out skateboards. Occasionally, we stole a couple of mollies from the shops. But it's true. In the seventies, we weren't labelled a gang. Fuck like, no, we were scouts. <laughs> <laughs> we had a haul the slot of shit we were stealing. <laughs> Away. I've just come back from Sydney, I was down there last week, and there's a big push at the moment because it was just after Australian Day. Ban the burka. Have you heard that? Ban the burka. What do you think? Yeah? I don't think we need to ban the burka. The thinking is, these people want to be in this country, they have to fit in. I don't think we need to ban the burka to get them to fit in. Just get them to wear a flamo one. <laughs> That'd work, wouldn't it? A bogan burger. <laughs> Can you picture it? A red flannelette burger with a packet of Winnie Blue wedged in on the side. But yeah, we're fun people. We are lazy. Good at sport in this country, yeah? Yeah. yeah. What's our best sport at the Olympics? Swimming. Swimming, normally. Yeah. Normally, last year we won four gold medals in sailing and six in rowing, and they reckon we don't need fucking boat people. <laughs> <laughs> There's ten medals we wouldn't have had, you know. <laughs> but no, you're right, swimming. It's because the way we teach our kids to swim, the rest of the world did. The Americans, they teach their kids going, son or daughter, but son, if you want to swim, get in the pool, try hard, put your mind to it, you could be the world champ. Australians, we're more like, well, what are you? A pool? Just <laughs> get the fucking pool, you <laughs> Who remembers that? Yeah. yeah, me too. I still remember my dad at the end of the pool going, that's it, keep kicking, you're coming up. <laughs> and that's why we swim quick. You know what they call the pool, do you? Look at Thorpe. <laughs> oh, come on, gold medals, world records, undefeated. He proved his point, he has to be watertight. <laughs> Just say how I see it. <laughs> Australians are fun. We love our sports. Do you play sport? What do you do? Cricket or golf? Cricket or golf? Love the golf game. Play twice a week at least. I'm a Moolma member. Where do you play? Carrara. Carrara. Great course. Don't get up there very often. What's your handicap? Six. Six. You're a good golfer. You've learnt. You've done all the shots in the world. You've done them all. You had to. You've done everything. You must have. You've obviously done the Kathy Freeman. You know that one. But if you're a six handicap, you know what that is. <laughs> Kathy Freeman. It's not pretty, but it runs. <laughs> <laughs> the Julia Gillard. It's ugly and to the left. <laughs> the condom shot. You know that one? Doesn't feel good, but it's safe. <laughs> it's in the fairway there somewhere. What about the wife's ass? You know that one? The wife's ass? That's out of bounds. <laughs> Maybe on an anniversary or something. Never it's out of bounds. You ever punt in a Thorpey? You know the Thorpey putt? You know when you punt it, tell me about that big and you miss it by this much? You step back and look at it and go, it looks straight. <laughs> That's a Thorpey. I love it, I do it. I surf. Golf is my second sport, surfing is my first one. Today I didn't play golf because it was going to rain. I surfed at Palm Beach. It was great. I love it. Any other surfers here? Yeah. No? I love it. You know, occasionally have a surf? I try. You try. Mate, the best <laughs> surfer in the water is the one having the most fun. Simple as that. For those that have never been surfing, there's only two drawbacks. Pretty obvious. Drowning and sharks. And I've always been scared of sharks. Told that to my dad. I said, Dad, I'm scared of sharks. He said, son, if you're scared of anything, study it. If you study it, you'll understand it. If you understand it, you won't fear it. So I studied sharks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you 